Hey, what's going on everybody? You're watching Rookie Outdoors. My name's Noah and today I'm going to show you guys how to go snapper fishing. And so what we're going to be doing is we're going to be getting bait here. Uh, I'm going to show you guys how to get your own bait using a sabiki rig. And then from there we're going to be using that bait as cut bait to catch the uh, snapper. So it should be a fun day. Should be some, uh, some success. A little early in the season for the bigger ones, but uh, I've been hearing from some friends that they've been doing pretty good at the Skyway, so we're gonna be headed out there today. So stay tuned, we'll see what happens. All right, so the first thing you wanna do is look for bait. You should be able to see it in the water, especially in the deeper areas. Especially the sunlight's out, you should be able to see them flashing. Sadly, there's not so much here, so we'll go down further. Just bounce it off the bottom. There we go. Oh yeah. That's a thread pin right there. That's what we're looking for. That's going to be our cut bait, y'all. Bait is in fat right now. I don't know if you guys can see it. They're just shining everywhere right now. I think I have like a one ounce weight on right now. At the bottom of a speaky. Let's jig it up. There we go. Double. Easy as that, baby. Dropped it. Great thing about this is you don't need a cast net. Just come out, jig your own, jig your own bait. There we go. Oh, <laughs> I do not know how I'm gonna send. Here we go. <laughs> right off the bat there. Let's go. <laughs> Triple baby. <laughs> there we go. Fishing a really simple rig here. All you have is a weight, a swivel, a few feet of meter, and a hook. I'm using a one out right now. You can use one or two out. <laughs> Here, you have one of your baits. So you've got a thread pin right there. Nice. Just cut off a little chunk. Just like that. Take the hook. Ready to rock and roll. Just like that, just let it sit. There we go. Oh yeah, a little mango.
Oh, he got me in the pilot. There he goes. He's out. Oh, yeah, baby. Oh, it's a grouper! Oh, it's a little gag! <laughs> That's so cool! So just got done. We got two snapper in the back and we're going to be doing a catch, clean and cook. Alrighty, so here at the gutting table, got my two fish, I got my fillet knife, my scaler, and my sharpener. So first things first, make sure this guy's sharp. It's not. It's been, see, it's been used quite a bit. Once my knife is sharpened, what I want to do is I want to scale these out because I like to cook, uh, cook them whole. You can't fillet them, it's just I personally, when I throw them on the grill, I like them whole. These little things are great. You can also use the back of your knife, you just got to go against the grain here to get all those scales off. Yeah, 
and same thing here. Find the anvil in down here. Just cut right through there. Like the breastplate. Go all the way down here. Go right behind that fin. there. Rip all that out. See, if you do that first, it takes out all the guts, which kind of helps. This one blame. Now there's one more step to this. Now, if you take your knife and then cut pretty deep here, kind of cut these into little chunks so you'll see when I'm done grilling, they come apart super easy. And come out boneless most of the time. Easy as that. There you go. They're ready for the grill now. Well, I'm going to wash them off first, but.
my lord, that's one of my favorite eating fish right there is a mangrove snapper. Thank you guys for uh, you know sticking through the video. I hope you guys learned something. You know, if there's something that you want to do, put it down in the comments below so we can go do it. You know, I that's what this channel's for. I'm not a professional, it's done this my whole life. This is about us learning new things and uh, being able to discover new things in the outdoors and you know anytime I can get a chance to teach you guys anything or just get started uh, I want to be able to do that so thank you all for watching also if you are one of the people that have done this many times before got some tips pointers put them down in the comments too for me and the other people there uh, but that's uh, that's gonna be it for today thanks all for coming subscribe like let me know what you want to do next. Have a great day. Bye.